Hi, little boo-boo there, <laughs> sorry. This is part two. I forgot to show you the answer key. Shame on you, mister, if you can't get that in a little more clearly. So my friends, after you get finished with your, um, after you get finished with your um, sprints, here are the answer keys for your parents to be able to look at. So you're going to be doing that. So there's your answer key excellently done so pause the video so you can check those and uh, let's take a look at the second sprint here is the second sprint and um, you are going to check this one after you pause the video you are going to pause the video and check that one okay now remember, this is something that your parents should be checking. So here is uh, the problem set for lesson 10. This is one possible way that you could have done this problem. I'm not saying it's the only way. It was the way that I chose how to do this problem. You can look at what I did. Yours might look different than this, but the bottom line is there are $110 bills, which is equal to a $1,000 bill. So there you go to give that one a whirl. And um, on the second one, I did not give you an example. I want you to try something that might be the same as the way I did it on this one, or you could try something different than what you did because we're looking for some different strategies on how you could figure out how many $10 bills are equal to a $1,000 bill. And of course, um, I will be looking for your exit ticket. Make sure that that gets sent. And I apologize to you that there is a part one video and a part two video, I don't know. I think, I don't know, I just forgot that I needed to show you the answers. So there you go, and you have another great day of learning.